Hello, this is Deepa from Deepa Staro. I'm back with uh, magical auto writing. Uh, so I will uh, connect with uh, my guides and I'll connect with the universe and see what messages come through. Okay, take a deep breath whenever you're joining me. Relax. <sighs> Relax. Mm. I'm hearing 777 okay you may not be able to see all the messages guys okay um, but I'll do my best some of you are going doing rigorous exercise or that is the uh, that's what is coming through re exercise okay exercise don't you don't have to be rigorous but definitely exercise is the need of the hour some kind of exercise even if it's just walking mm. some of your vocal cords someone's vocal cords here are kind of opening up after being tight for a very long time so throat chakra is getting released throat chakra is going to start purging healers this group or whoever is watching you're meant to be a healer of some kind mm. office may some issues with the in the office ego clashes for somebody here your job is to stay away from all this observe detach don't get in go don't get into the story that's for somebody here not for everyone if you have your own business the business is going to thrive okay you will make your mark in the world you will make your mark okay you will be known you will be known very known you know fame energy here okay mm. karmic debt has been paid off so you can breathe better okay some of you who have had breathing issues is going to clear up 888 okay 1122 when you are breathing pranayama is going to help you because some of you are not breathing properly work on breath breath work before you do anything just compose yourself with breath take a few deep breaths inhale exhale and then begin the work and you'll see the difference in the quality so before you're about to cook say something as simple as cooking do some breath work before you cook mm, okay relax and then cook because the change you will see the difference in anything you do some of you are very frustrated okay this collective i am sensing some frustration in this collective because you are doing your best to take off you are doing your best to do better yet you feel like i'm stagnant i don't understand why i am so stagnant i don't understand why i'm not making a move forward i don't understand why things are not moving at the pace i want them to move frustrated because of stagnation okay will this clear up spirit it will in a couple of months or less depends on divine timing it's almost like you're being forced to pause here forced to pause or forced to slow down hmm? clean your home maybe this is why the slow down because you're meant to prepare for this huge expansion that will come in this is for somebody here um, you know and uh, the pause right now nothing is happening nothing is moving or seemingly that's what your ego mind tells you Uh, there's always movement in the ethers we don't see it so we believe nothing's happening right so clean your home that will help you to get organized get organized with your work like if you are a youtube content creator get organized with when will you do the videos how often will you do them what kind of videos do you want to do them like get a plan going i'm just giving you a basic example here this is with your work okay whichever that work is so clean your home declutter prepare as if you're going to get very busy prepare so 
So get that mental thing going on first and do the physical thing and then the, 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 the work will come in. Money is not as important as you think it is right now. What is more important is your mindset. More important than money is your mindset. Your mindset is the one that is mistaken here or that is messed up here. So you are being healed. Your mindset is being healed here with these delays. Also a little bit of an ego, you know, like the more your ego tells you now, 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 universe is saying, wait, wait, wait. It's like, it's like that, you know, the more your ego says progress. If you don't progress, you're nothing. Or if you don't progress, that means you've failed again. Or if you don't progress, that means you've not made it again. The universe is saying, okay, pause. Pause, clear out your mind, clear out those thoughts. Yes, this is not easy, okay? I'm not going to sit here and make up a story about, uh, oh yeah, this is easy, da, da, da. Yes, this will take work, but this is the work of your lifetime. Once you clear your mindset, once you get the right thoughts in, once you get the right fertilizer in, in your garden, the plants will just grow, the flowers will just bloom. So yes, okay, this feels like the time some of you must do this, not everybody. So spend time in nature, okay, take better care of your physical body, okay, connect with the mantra, okay, mantra meditation is coming through. I really wanted to do a mantra chanting meditation, but see, the weekdays are just getting beyond me and the weekend seems to be the only time. At the same time, I don't want to bombard my feed with back-to-back -back videos, uh, not because I don't care about the views and the algorithm, it's just that it feels like I don't want to overwhelm you with my presence and with my videos but the weekend seems to be the only time I can do this um, I know you can schedule videos and all I just I'm not I if I create I just share create share that's the flow I like to maintain not keep it stagnating in my inbox yeah, I'm not such kind of a person so well you know it is what it is I will I do feel like doing a video on mantras but okay coming back to you mantra japa will help you, will help you, okay, a little bit of humility of seeing the bigger picture, of seeing that yes, from my human, when I say humility, I'm not saying you're arrogant, I am saying what the message I'm receiving is, yes, you've tried everything from your human level, now just surrender to divine, surrender to the universe and say, I have done everything from my side or I'm trying to overcome, please help me or please show me that I'm on the right path, like connect and surrender the outcome, surrender the speed with which things must flow according to you, to the universe. We are at the end of the day just very much like, uh, you know, it will happen when it has to happen, okay? That is the biggest lesson. If you can get into that surrender energy, embrace surrender with everything, anything that you are unable to solve by yourself, just say, you know, I'm just giving example because I'm really tapping into Krishna's energy here. Lord Krishna, I have tried everything from my side. Or divine, I have tried everything from my side. Now I surrender myself to you. I surrender the, my path to you. I surrender my progress to you. Right? That's it. Then the feelings of, he will give you the, the comfort you need. Mm. Some of you want to take a course or want to offer a course. Do it. Do it. Expect. Don't expect big, big things. To see, when you ex have big expectations, you're setting yourself up for a disappointment. Okay? Have realistic expectations. I'm not saying to not have expectations, but have realistic expectations. So when I offer something, people may like it, people may not like it. But I will do my thing because I feel like producing it. I feel like sharing a course. I will do it. Like Try not to get into that... Uh, why are people not liking it? Like, try not to do that, okay? Mm. Hold on. Some of you are meant to create art. Some of you are meant to create art. And this art will take off. In the past, if your art did not uh, get visibility, it will. In 2025 is a big year for your art. Whatever this art is, I will leave it to you to define. For some... You're meant to write a book. The story for the book will show up. The med more meditation you do, the more time you spend in nature, the story that you need for the book or the what am I going to write, that's going to show up. For some, this is a love story. 
that I feel like there's a love story that you wished somebody here wanted to write. For some, this is a self-help, self-help book. Okay? For some, calligraphy is coming through. This is in your blood, guys, calligraphy. This, you've done this art before. Wow, I'm really getting a past life story here for somebody. Just bear with me because I just don't want to miss out on all the messages because I don't want to rush because somebody is, it's a great story here. I'm getting this image of somebody who was a calligrapher in a um, king's court. That's what you did. Wow. I got chills. I got chills when I said this. You were a calligrapher in a past, past lifetime. Wow. And were you famous or were you famous? You were very well known for this. Okay? Okay? Wow. Okay? Wow. So you are getting back to that gift. That's the ancient gift that's unveiling for somebody. For some, another ancient gift is unveiling. I cannot see it. I just tapped into this for somebody here. What does the collective need to know? Okay, when you are stressed or when you know, when things are external to you are not in your control, Focus on what can you control. Can you control the amount of water you drink? Can you control the amount of exercise you do? Can you control um, like uh, your spending and make home cooked meals? Like try to uh, see, bring your focus to all the areas you can control and you're actually doing a good job. I want to tell you, you're all doing a good job with your life and with your circumstance. Okay, you're doing a good job. You are. Nobody tells you that. Nobody pats on your back. Please don't, don't take it seriously. The universe is saying you are doing a good job. Anybody else in your situation would have given up or been in a worse case. You are really doing your best. You are hanging in there. You are doing the best. Great. Fantastic. Okay. So big hug to you. Um, you are doing a good job. This is confirmation in some area of your life. And you will know which one. You are already doing whatever you can. Mm, karma bad. Those people who felt like karmically connected to you and they were causing, uh, coming back repeatedly into your life and causing you trauma, they're going to clear out. No more space for these people in your life. No more space. <sighs> Be mindful of what, you know, Things you're dropping into other people's baskets here, buckets. Like somebody posts something and then you leave a nasty comment. I'm just giving you examples. Or somebody says something and you're like, eh, I wish you did better. Like try to not be that. Okay, try to not create fresh um, energetic uh, uh, stories for yourself. Okay, if you cannot say something nice, don't say anything at all. Is what I'm getting. And that's a message for somebody very much here. Oh, I'm always... Move what you know, I'm always, I say whatever I want. I just give people the truth. Okay, so then you're creating a karmic wave here. You're creating new stories here is what I'm getting. There is truth and then there is being unkind and being true and then there's just being truth. You know that, right? You're like, you know, when you have to give the truth and which, what can the other person handle, right? Go with that. Or just keep your, maintain your peace, which is what I started somewhere here. Keep your, hold your peace there. If there is any office drama, you will be fine. Okay? You'll be fine for some person. But it will make you rethink the job you're doing. It will make you rethink, am I even meant to be here? Those things will come up. Mm. Lentils are very beneficial here for somebody. Eating more lentils will ground your energy. Same with strawberries. Okay. Aloe vera. Try to use aloe vera for most of your problems because it will help you. Okay. Again, take this with a pinch of salt. If you're allergic, don't do it. Don't do it. This is just for somebody here. This is a collective, right? Even I'm not getting messages for myself here. So that's how collective this is. So I also, when I hear this back, I have to pick and choose because not every message will be for me. So that's how big this is. When I say the collective, this is whoever comes across this video. 
This can be uh, somebody who's not even come into my life, like I'm not even subscribed, just watching me and they may get a message here. Or this can be somebody else, right? So like discernment, Vedas. Some of you will be very, very drawn to learning more or listening about the Vedas, especially the Rig Veda is coming through for somebody here. Okay? Uh, don't worry about it if you don't know what are Vedas or what, like what is this. Don't worry about it. If you're meant for it, it will just show up. It will just show up. Meditation is a must, guys. The next few days, few weeks, meditation is a must. It will also help you with the mindset that I was talking about. I don't know. I'm just getting lost in somebody's sadness here. Okay? If you're sad, what is the advice for this person? Spend time in nature. Nature will heal you. Okay? Understanding the... Um, the finite nature of things, like as in, this too shall pass, okay? Nothing is going to remain the same. This too shall pass. Everything that's coming up will pass. Every emotion, good, bad, especially sadness, won't be here with you forever. Don't make it a part of your, don't attach too strongly to that identity of, I am a sad person. I am sad. Like try not to attach yourself to the identity. Just let it come and go. This will also pass. Okay? This is a very temporary state of same thing for sadness, same thing for confusion, that confusion that I mentioned. Same thing for feeling stuck. This too shall pass. Everything. Nothing remains the same. The good times don't stay forever. Same way, the bad times also don't stay forever. You got to be your pep, you got to be your cheerleader here. Be your cheerleader. Who else? Is there anybody else around you cheerleading you? No? Then you got to do it for yourself. You got to do it for yourself. Be your cheerleader. Okay? What would you like if you're sad? Ask yourself, what do I want to eat? What gives me comfort? What kind of clothes make me feel good or comfortable? Okay? When do I feel good do i feel good when i listen to this music or this music okay i will listen to that i will do anything i will do the mantra japa i will do anything that is in my control and in my power to comfort and soothe myself okay nothing is external nobody external to us can actually make us feel better for a long time it is the soul wanting you to, to take care of itself you needing to take care of yourself. I'm getting very sad here for somebody here. Okay? I'm so sorry that you're going through so much sadness. Hmm. So can you be your own cheerleader? Okay? Pep yourself up. Take good care of yourself. Eat better. When you eat better, you feel good. You, be, you feel well taken care of. When you're rather than when you're eating junk. You feel like a, somebody here, you eat junk and then you feel like you're rejecting yourself. You're rejecting your future. That's for somebody. Like there is this energy of, oh, I ate junk again. It makes you feel um, worried about your health. Then don't do it. I know it, it, is, it takes a little. Maybe you need to get up early to chop your vegetables, make your own food. And then you feel sad that why I have to make my own things? Why somebody else is not doing it for me? Somebody else should understand that I'm not doing well and make something for me. Let all that go. That's all the mind chatter. That's all the ego trying to tell you you're miserable. Look at you. Your life is miserable. See people around you. Nobody's supporting you. It's all the rhetoric of the... It's all the chatter of the ego. Okay? Can you please drop all that and say, I don't need anybody. I, am, I got me. I got me. I will take care of me. I will cook the food I feel like eating. Okay, so take a little responsibility, be responsible a little bit more for your own healing. Be responsible for your own healing. Please, if this is what, if this, you can do this in this last two months of 2024, you will start off 2025 like a magnet for all the things that you actually wish. Okay? Other people can only take us so far. The rest of the way must be you. So you're dropping the ball here. 
So you're waiting for somebody to open the door and say, I love you or, oh my God, let me do this for you or let's be, you know, um, somebody here, you're very lonely. Okay, you're like, can you be my friend? Oh, I want to be your friend. Who is going to come in and say all that? Be your best friend. Then you will attract those who also know how to take care of themselves. So then they are not depleting you when you're, you know, in your new life. 2025 is a brand new life. Okay, sunshine, just hang in there. Just hang in there. 2025 is your brand new life. Look at December as the month where you hone yourself, where you bring yourself back to strength, mental strength, mental clarity, a good diet, simple changes but sustainable changes. Simple but sustainable. What is that sustainable? Simple and sustainable changes must be made and you will you must find what is simple for me what is sustainable for me i had to make that shift i realized i no longer can make videos it's very hard for me during the weekday to make videos because i have other responsibilities i have people i take care of i have things to do i have bills to pay okay so i'm actually like you know doing many things so then I said the only time I can actually do this for some time for the month of December and don't make big big plans for the month of December that is what next four weeks simple next four weeks I will do my best to do my videos only on the weekends but I won't drop it I will push it to the weekend so I'm trying this experiment what why am I writing all this down I don't care like why uh, like try that say mini make it for the next week I will make Pre, you know, meal prep so I'm not eating junk I will buy fruit and keep it ready so I will always reach out for the fruit I will drink more water right I will walk this many steps one one week ke liye planning karo yaar. like plan for one week and then assess at the end of the week what you need to tweak or what you need to change then make a plan for the second week take it one week at a time this will work for you trust me on this try it at least and then you can please get back to me and say deepa you suck this message didn't work for me i'm happy to hear that but because i know you tried it and then while you're trying other people's advice you will come up with your own advice you will come up with your own way say hey deepa said one week at a time i think i'll do better if i do two weeks at a time okay so um you will do that you will find your own way to do it but you must do it you must do something. If you are in a gut hole, you can't be like, I'm in a hole, I'm in a hole. No, do something to crawl out of the hole. And who can motivate us? Nobody has the time. Nobody cares enough. Even if they do care enough, they've got their own problems going on. So who must be that person who will pick you up? It must be you. You, you are strong enough. You are strong enough. You are brave enough. You are capable enough. You're creative enough to find solutions. Okay? You can persevere and you must. You must persevere. You must not give up. Okay? So I want you to say, I can move mountains. I can move mountains. I can move mountains. I can move mountains. Okay? Then when you can move mountains, what is a little to-do list? What is meal prep? When, you, when you're capable of moving mountains, what is cooking healthy meals for yourself? What is taking better care of your body? What is taking, what is a few steps? Nothing. So get into this. I can move mountains. And then everything else in your life will feel minimized. It won't be like a big to-do thing. It won't be like a big mountain. Okay? so there is massive amount of purging that's going on which is the reason why all these feelings or all this self-doubt could come up to the surface for some of you okay so let it happen when else is a good time to purge now it's a good time to purge now okay this can also be clearing clutter physical clutter or donating some of you will benefit a lot from um feeding feeding the hungry whichever way you can okay
Mm. I'm getting the energy of moth, moth and butterflies. I'm especially seeing a blue blue butterfly, throat chakra mm. activation, which I mentioned. Mm. I'm feeling one 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 one. I'm seeing ten thousand dollars. Okay, USD. Somebody coming into this money. I'm, you will hear motorcycles or lot of noise, um, sudden noise. Mm, makeup. Some of you want to do better makeup, or you will learn how to do makeup. A makeup artist, or you will become very good at making your face. You know, like very good with. You going to look like a different person. Okay. Mm. Some of you, your dark circles, if you struggle with that, work extra hard on clearing them because they are causing you to doubt yourself and causing you to not feel good about yourself. So try to find a solution here. Keep at it. Whatever it is, keep at it. Mm. You will find a solution or they will lighten up enough for you to feel confident. Okay, I am seeing a triangle. Triangular manifestations. Mm. I'm feeling the energy of Phoenix. Karpuram, Karpuram is camphor. Some of you need to cleanse your home with camphor. If you have it, if you don't have it, just sage or just do incense. Just cleanse your home, cleanse your workspace, cleanse your tarot decks if you have tarot decks. Mm, your hormones need a little bit of a regulation or healing. Okay, hormonal health. Some of you need to pay attention to that. Mm. I'm feeling the energy of Lord Jesus. Thank you so much for coming through with love and light. Thank you, Lord Jesus, for coming through with love and light. Thank you. You are a healer. I said it, right? He is the master healer. So you are the healer. You are the healer. You are the guru. You are the guide. Okay? And not for everybody. For those who wish to, who look at you that way and who are receiving benefits from you. One doctor doesn't, cannot heal everybody. One doctor cannot, like when we say that, oh, this person went to this doctor and they got completely cured. And then the same person, another person goes and gets no relief, right? So we say, right, not, not all doctors are for like, for you, like, uh, so you will connect, some of you will connect with the healer or the guide who is for you. Others will reject some healers, some he reject some guides and move on to somebody else. Everything is okay. Everything is as it should be. Stop doubting yourself. If you feel in your gut, this person is not healing me or these messages are not for me or just not in alignment, please, that's your soul telling you, find somebody who is in alignment with you. You must listen to that. You must listen to that. Don't overstay your welcome or don't overstay in places that are not for you. This is a clear message for somebody here. If you go to someone's house, you don't feel so welcome. Why do you go so often? I want to ask you. Don't go. Okay, that's for somebody here. This can be again. <laughs> if you get if you get onto this online world, um, if you're always uh, uh, cribbing, uh, like, I don't know, I don't know, this person's energy is iffy or this channel is iffy, don't go there, please. This is the universe's way of protecting you. This is the universal way. Universe, is, your guides are telling you this is not for you. Uh, get that, get that, please. Okay, magic is happening all around you. Magic happens when you smile. <laughs> magic happens when you smile, it seems. So somebody needs to smile more. Okay, magic happens when you smile. Okay, Leela, like some of you are going to really see the Leela here. Leela is like the the Maya of the world. Somebody is going to see that, oh, this is one more trap. This is one more the Maya of the world. You're going to see the illusions of the world, okay? You're going to see the this thing that you were, the play that you were stuck in. You, are, you will see the play of the universe in something here. For some, destiny is calling big and strong, okay? Destiny is calling big and strong. Some of you are going to be in this Queen of Swords energy, okay? Um, and you're going to speak your truth. You're going to spit it out there. You're going to tell people. 
okay this is how i feel this is how i've always felt or this is how i feel about what you said you're going to speak up okay that's again the throat chakra um yeah i think some of you do need to speak up so to speak up but again try to be as gentle as you can be mm, porcupine is coming through porcupine spirit mm? just give me one second porcupine spirit what do you want the collective to know yeah healthy boundaries it goes with this creating a healthy boundary or connecting with some people but now in a different way choosing to picking and choosing where you put your time to where you put your energy to where you put your attention to picking and choosing it and you must otherwise you will have no one to blame in 2025 if some just when you're about to take off if someone gives you the same old lesson again then you cannot blame anybody but yourself is what i'm hearing so try to understand the lessons of 2024 such self reflection is a must and then rectify okay so rectify that's also why the pause for somebody here uh, in your uh, external world or not movement happening because you need to self reflect what it is that you cannot and must not repeat in 2020 like what happened in 2024 that you don't want to repeat in 2025 okay Mm. love is in the air you will feel more kind to others you will feel some of you will feel more generous to others family members i see you spending more time in nature i see you connecting really with uh, nature a cow spirit is coming through you will experience some miracle some of you miracle miracles and magic miracle and magic begins now okay all right i have to go now because um, this is all i uh, am getting honestly but definitely work with this kind of an energy to manifest a triangle a pyramid okay pyramid for some egypt is calling for some okay you will hear more and more about your past life through random messages from people okay all right so take care be well uh, i will get on to the mantra thing not today maybe but maybe later this evening or tomorrow max okay uh, i will i think oh, god willing god willing right but um, thank you thank you for watching and uh, take care i'll see you some other time